Hi there. Have you ever wondered why some files open and separate as spot colors while others open and show nine halftone separations? I'm here to clear this up for you. This is by design. Sep Studio is smart, very smart, and it's not fooled by simply changing a file's format or extension. Sep Studio will automatically separate a file into raster spot process halftones or traditional vector solid spot color separations based on the internal file data. That's the best part of Step Studio. Need a traditional spot color separation with solid areas, but only have a PNG, JPEG, or TIFF image? Opening and then resaving that file as a PDF is not going to deliver what you're looking for. Step Studio will see right through that because the image data is still raster. What you need to do in these cases is auto trace the file in Corel Draw or Adobe Illustrator, converting that raster data to vector and then save the file as a PDF. Now, Step Studio will produce the results that you're looking for. All right, so let's go ahead and try this together. All right, so here I have a file that I want to separate into spot colors, but it has already been saved as a PNG. So I can open this in Corel Draw or Adobe Illustrator, but just saving it as a PDF does not change a thing. The data is still the same. It's raster. It's just saved with a different file format. And this will not produce spot colors. If you are looking for tonal spot process sim process separations, save your files as RGB, TIFF, JPEG, or PNG. If you want to make traditional spot color separations from these same formatted files, you must first open and auto trace them before saving them as PDF. Now you know how to navigate these powerful abilities in Step Studio using them to your business advantage. Freehand and you, together, we got this.